In this lecture, we will talk about the Visual Basic Script Editor. To open this, we need to go to Global Script and Visual Basic Script Editor, we go right click and open. After this, we get the window that contain on the left side the tree with project modules, standard modules, actions and code templates. The project standard and actions is the same like we talked few lessons like, uh, before and the templates is the help how to write some functions. On top left we have three buttons about the new project module, new standard module and new actions. We have also the open the function, save function, copy paste, it's normal way of function editor. We have some possibilities to copy, paste and normal files edits. After we created new standard module, we can make our font editor inside our window and we can make the font bigger or just other font type. In Visual Basic Script in WinCC we can use the things like HIME runtime dot and we can make tags we make the name of tag and we, we make dot read, write or value in this kind we can read data from this tag alarm1 and this visual basic script editor showing us the possibility to run additional things into our objects anyway Let's go to show how this editor works. We can make the space, we can comment and uncomment some lines inside our script. We can make this with all lines. We can make some bookmarks where we go. For example, if our script is big, we can make some bookmarks to find this. We can use find and replace options we can make that filtering data only profiles only ok functions we can make the syntax check so if our script is having errors or not we can pick WinCC tags directly from window we can also take the object properties directly so we have start PDL button first and for example fill color and we can pick this element into our script on the last tabs we have also the properties we can make who created the function who changed the dates, time and we can make the versions we can also set the password in WinCC scripts if we put the passwords in my opinion there is no way to open this and uh, if we put the password into functions no one can open this without the password there is no administrative passwords for all SCADA system on WinCC V7 so if you forget about the password you can't open this again now if we put save we need to save this inside WinCC programming V7 so it's our pro project folder in this folder we have the script lib folder inside this we have our module new function and if we go to tree visual basic script editor 
and project modules, we have also our first module inside our project modules. It was just the general information about the Visual Basic Editor. Let's go forward to check how to use scripts inside VCC V7.